Windows 11 includes built-in apps for screen recording and capturing a screenshot. Let's look at how to do this. I would recommend using Snipping Tool to take screenshots and video. This allows you to capture specific parts of the screen and select the capture mode as well as adding a delay before capture and this comes built in with Windows 10 and 11. So open up the start menu, type in snipping and it should come up with the snipping tool. Once this is opened, this window will then pop up. Here, by default, it will go into the screenshot mode. You can just click new and then select an area of the screen that you want to snip. And this will open up in the new window here. There we go, as you can see, that captures the screen that I've selected. You could then select the save icon on the top right. This will open up a new window. And for example, we could save this to the desktop and save that there. I would recommend enabling the multi-window setting. So if we click the three dots up here, go to settings at the bottom. As you can see here, there's a multiple windows option. Just make sure this checkbox is on. Then if we go back and say I click new and then took another screenshot up here. This would then save it in a separate window so you wouldn't lose the previous one if you hadn't saved it. As you can see, there are a few different options. Rectangle, window, full screen, free form. If we select window mode, for example, and then select new, we could then just click on the word application and that will then screenshot the whole app here, as you can see. There's also a delay option. So if something pops up after a few seconds, you could enable this three second, five second, 10 second delay. So for example, if I click three second delay and click new, After a few seconds, that should then allow you to take another screenshot again. If you'd like to record the screen, you can then select the camera option here. It will flick between like that, the blue line underneath. Then you can select new. At the top of the screen, it should come up with a start button and a timer. First of all, you just want to select the area of the screen that you want to record. Just do that. Then click start. That's now running and at the top, there'll be a pause, a stop and a bin icon. We'll just stop the recording now. As you can see, that's now recorded a video for us. And then you can save on the top right like before and choose a location for that. And that's it. If you like this video and want to see more, subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell. See you in the next one.